Hello, I'm Adam and today we will take a look inside uh, that uh, Ryobi batteries and uh, I will compare if this uh, latest generation uh, has better cells than this uh, battery even without the uh, state of charge checking and uh, we'll check what failed in those examples because I must say this one is pretty young uh, battery because as we can see week 16 2023 and uh, in this example uh, it's end of the year 22 so yeah those should be alive so that might be interesting why those failed uh, so uh, let's uh, look inside and uh, see if is it reparable or no at the beginning uh, i will open the newest uh, model and uh, as we can see the screws are on the side and there is a seal so if you remove this uh, cap i think uh, that means warranty is void and you won't be able to do anything but of course i've bought those for very cheap and of course without warranty so let's open okay all screws are done but this one sealed and how to remove that oh it's pretty hard I'm not sure how we are supposed to open this. Oh, there I found it. Well, uh, so it has pretty big cup. Wow. But the screw is same as others. Okay. Now let's open it and see what's inside. Oh, first uh, look, mm, there is a heatsink for the terminal. And yeah, of course it's that, I was checking the voltage output and I've got pretty zero volts. Okay, and uh, next I think we could, yeah, we could remove the clips. Next. Okay, I can see. Oh! Okay, and we've got access to cells. And let's measure them. <clears throat> okay, where's the main minus? And uh, probably there. Okay, so first cell. Zero. Second cell. <laughs> Half volt. <laughs> oh my gosh. Next cell. Wow. Another cell. Okay. Wow. Nice garbage I bought. <laughs> okay, about cells, uh, unfortunately I cannot see what cells there are. Uh, I need to remove at least one cell. But to be honest, it's very nicely uh, soldered, it's very... Oh. Wow. Um, There we go. I hope you see that. LS LR eighteen sixty five LA MM thirty one twenty eight and I think serial number. Nothing more. Well, uh, let's see what we will get. And uh, this battery has uh, twenty amps uh, continuous G discharge rate with pulses up to 50 amps but pulses like one second uh, so well 
I'm sad that this is not like LG or Samsung battery cell. Yeah, okay, and uh, since it's totally dead, it's time to move to another battery, which is about to be worse because it has poor BMS, etc. <laughs> we will see. Wow. Yeah, this is how you should open those batteries. Okay. And let's see what's inside. Is it oil? Yes. Hmm. It doesn't want to open. Okay. Um, oh, okay. The BMS is, <laughs> let's say, much simpler. Uh, let's remove the springs. Really, I can't remove it. Okay. Can we remove the? Okay. Yeah. Oh. That's different design. And what are the cells? Oh, EV. Uh, so uh, those are the EV brand, uh, the Chinese brand. And EV ICR 18650-20P. And I will check what are parameters of those. I've checked and those cells uh, have similar discharge rate uh, as uh, 20 amps. Uh, so, uh, answering the question, is this older battery worse uh, than this? I would say no, those can output exactly the same uh, power. And I would say that I met EV brand uh, in the electric scooters. While I'm first seeing the Lishin company first time, and it's light to be honest. Whatever. Uh, let's check the voltage of the cells. If I will get another all zeros, that will be very bad deal. Uh, okay, you see that? You see that? First one. Wow. Okay, without any... Oh, it's, th this one is glued, but whatever. Uh, there will be two zero. Oh, there I can check. Yeah, so... <laughs> uh, yeah, so uh, this one is unlucky one. <laughs> Uh, fortunately, I've bought uh, those two batteries for like $10 with shipping, so no, $15 with shipping, so that's not too bad. Uh, so, yeah, I've got maybe the BMSs. I'm not sure if they are working. A quick update from the future. Uh, so, I found the purpose for uh, those uh, batteries. I've bought uh, LG MJ1 uh, cells, those are rated for 10 amps, but their capacity is uh, 3500 milliamp hours, so uh, they won't be suitable for high power demand devices, like uh, yeah, some powerful drills or something, but uh, I found a purpose uh, for this battery to be a very good battery for uh, lights. Uh, in a small form factor, because it's size of 2 amps, uh, 2 amp hours, I've got uh, 3.5 amp hours, yeah, so uh, that's uh, how I will use it, and uh, finally I'm happy with that, that's it, thanks for watching, please leave a comment and hit the subscribe button, bye!